Hey there, and welcome to Real Investment News. I'm Mike O'Neill. The big three has been trading a little bit lower today. The Dow is down 34 points. The S&P is down four points. And just in the past few minutes, the Nasdaq actually finally came up for air at two points above to right now it is hovering at 6,752. Now we are going to be watching closely to see if anything can turn this around, but if not, this will be the first time in the past nine weeks that the Dow and S&P have ended the week lower than where it started. But there are a few bright spots today. Uh, media stocks are actually limiting the slide. We talked about how Disney missed the mark in its quarterly earnings results, but it is up more than 2% today after it announced that it has plans for a new Star Wars trilogy. I tell you what, I am personally very excited about that. Plus, it appears the negotiations between Disney and 21st Century Fox are still happening. Shares of Fox are up 16% since those negotiations were announced earlier this week. Right now, 20th Century Fox is trading about 1%, um, point and a half actually, percent higher. General Electric's new CEO is reportedly planning to lay off about 100 sales staff and other members in its software division on Monday. That's all to improve the company's profits. Now, since August, the company has been reducing its corporate staff and slow down construction of its headquarters. Now, if you look, GE stock is actually up 2% in anticipation about that, but it's never about the one day. And I'm going to take a moment here to actually stretch this out because if you take it out and you take a look at the year, it is really kind of stunning. GE is down more than 35% since the beginning of the year. Now, that is it for our mid-afternoon market report. Be sure to follow us on Facebook and Twitter and subscribe to our YouTube page. There is a lot of big things coming. You want to be a part of it. Do not miss a moment. Thank you very much for watching, and we will see you at the close.